It's time to get a little weird. Lucas Baker is kind of a loser. A dummy, if you will. You can tell that from the disrespect he is shown by his father as the old man stabs him at the dinner table. Again. Didn't you hate it when that happened growing up? Not again. This missing tooth yokel with a horrible accent acts immature, throws food while eating, and whines like a baby. He must be a millennial. While not much is known about Lucas at this point, a lot of different pieces are seeming to come together. And wouldn't you know it, somehow the damn dummy finger is involved. So put on your tinfoil hats and watch out for men in white fans on this video as we talk about some strange things involving Lucas Baker in... Let's start with everyone's favorite item, the dummy finger. Notice the shape that the dummy finger forms when it joins with the dummy hand. Looks like the letter L. Not just the first letter in Lucas, but also an international symbol for loser. Le who, the her. And this game described left hand of the mannequin belongs to a dummy. The same way the left hand of a Lucas also belongs to a dummy. Where did Jack stab his son? The loser? Ah. Left arm. Look at that dummy's mangled hand. Okay, okay, maybe that wasn't done on purpose. Maybe it's just a coincidence, like the fact that Lucas's shirt has his name spelled without the vowels on it. Did he just steal that from Ethan because it looked like his name, or is he just not so great at spelling? Even if all that is just random, there is one thing we know from watching him at the dinner table for 30 seconds. He appears to be an adult, and yet he acts like someone who didn't grow up. Almost like a plant would when you get a bad seed that won't grow up. Bad seed, apparently. So maybe this whole thing is a reach, and the monotony of the nothingness in the new Twilight demo has me on a witch hunt for conspiracies. But I don't know, the ass named Lucas could be a bigger key to the mysteries of the bayou than we think, pointing us in the right direction. The truth is out there, Scully, and we'll find it in... Resident Evil 7. Crimson Army, am I the dummy? Let me know in the comments, throw in your thoughts on Lucas, and don't forget to click the thumbs up finger and subscribe.